1964, and he had done these songs of yours, and then comes this song you wrote called You've Lost That Love and Feeling. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, did you present it to him first? Like, hey, Phil, here's something you might like. How did, how did that happen? No. Our favorite song at the time was Baby, I Need Your Loving. And that became a template, you know, where we open it into a really beautiful big chorus. Baby, I need your love. God. Anyway, um, so using that as a template, we had started to write, you never close your eyes anymore when I kiss your lips. Anyway, we wrote two verses and a chorus. And I, I said, let's play it for Phil. So, and I was, I was, I couldn't figure out how to end the each chorus. So anyway, we played it for Phil. It made him cry when he, he said, man, that's gonna make me, make me cry. The line was something beautiful's dying. Yeah, that's oh the line, yeah, that's yeah. the line. Especially where it, where it came melodically. Then he added conceptually a very important part of that record, which is the middle part. Bum, bum, dum, ah. dum, dum. You know, and we started then, but all of us started to just, you know, improvise. Oh, you know, baby, baby, I get down on my knees for you, you know. So we did that, wrote, had a complete song. Now we had, now he came to play, we wanted to play it for the Righteous Brothers. And I sang the song, and Bill Medley said, would be great for the Everly Brothers. And uh, he didn't. He, he really didn't like the song, you know. And they added like the, the screaming on, you know, on the baby, that, baby, 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 yeah, baby. Yeah. They improvise that. Yeah, 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 yes, which is pretty right. great. Well, it's anyway, got. I mean, it's got. It makes that tension. It's that that oh, moment yeah. is just. It's pure tension. It was, it's very bright to have put that in. When you when you finish the first two verses and two choruses. Did you and Cynthia feel that you really had something there, or was just another just another song? Or what, what did you feel about it? Phil Spector says it's going to be most important, a very important song for you and Cynthia, and uh, so we believed him. Uh, and, I see. But, but but when we played the song, Bobby said, "Hey, what am I supposed to do while while the big the big guy's singing?" And Phil didn't miss a beat. He said, "You'll be going to the bank." <laughs> Which is why, and they ended up buying the bank. Oh boy, did they ever! The most played song of the twentieth century. Yeah, yeah, that is unbelievable. I mean, it really—who knew that it was going to end up being that way?